What is up, my sweet little baby boys? Reading some more to your eternity, chapter 32. I'm not sure what arc we're going to be getting into now, but we are, again, trying to figure out what emo is. Yeah, I can imagine. I, I'm so happy that he's actually experiencing all this emotion now. Yeah, this is the first time he's actually requested his presence. The first time he said, like, he wanted to he actually requested to talk with him. Yeah, what, what what does he want? I still don't really know what his ultimate goal is here. So, okay, it is what I thought. Like, you know, the world is going to end at some point. He needs to harbor everything of the Earth. Okay, so he's going to try to become not him anymore. He will become the potato. Yep, a potato. But nope, he won't let her. He won't let him. That is not abandoning yourself. Hmm. Are we going to fight already? Right now? Huh? That's sent, but why? Oh, it's Puron. I realized something. I came to Takanana thinking I might be able to help you. But in return, there was nothing I could do, so I decided I'd just go with you again. What? Okay. This booze man is going to stay behind, I guess. He's not going to take her with him. Yeah, and Piron, you're way too old, man. I guess so. Even if she ends up dying along the way, then he's trying to drag her back home. But yeah, she doesn't have much time left, so might as well enjoy it. Might as well do something with it. Oh, right, yeah, he can just make his own food anytime he needs it. So I'll never have to go hungry. <laughs> I said I don't want it. <laughs> He's being such a baby. Promise me one thing. Don't die. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. She's already old as shit. Alright, and we're at another city already. <laughs> Just slurping down. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's not gonna protect the city, right? Only a little. Got him boozier. Come. <laughs> the, the tilde there and everything. Piron. Okay, so he can actually get tracking on where it is right now. So it's six kilometers northwest. Yeah. Try and tell her. Man in black. Okay, good. We are talking about it. I like that we can actually discuss things in the series. We don't have to hide things from people. What do you want to do? Yeah. Who cares about what he wants? What do you want to do? If the knocker attacks, yeah, I'll be the only one who can protect her. Can't win, not right now. Hmm, it feels like I'm forgetting something. What is he forgetting? Hmm. <laughs> well, you can't eat it, but it's probably be fine. But I, I understand. You might think there's something weird with it. Oh, right. Does he not even remember March at all? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, March was taken from him, but it's, like, literally taking the memories. Uh, which I suspected, but I don't really think about it now. Now that it's, like, permanently gone. Like, in the fights, yeah, but now. Yeah, he doesn't remember her. Yeah, so he can't remember her or anything she said or anything, but he does kind of remember, like, something was stolen from me. And now, knowing that something really important was taken, yeah, the gravity of what has occurred. Oh, man. I really hope he never gets anything permanently taken from him. That would be fucking terrible. I don't want to get into a re-zero situation. <laughs> yeah, if we get beaten again in any other form, we're going to have it taken from us. 
Yeah. If you're forgotten, that's when you die. That's like one of my favorite, you know, concepts ever. Uh, and it's really what I live my life by. It's why I have this channel, right? You know? Gotta do something worth remembering. Alright. We gotta power up. We gotta get new forms. Get new experiences. New stimuli. Yeah, we gotta expose ourselves to new stimuli. How do we do that? Problem is living targets. As long as they're alive, I can't turn into them. Okay, so yeah. They, as long as they're alive, you can't do it. Don't like this feeling. Yeah. I know what you mean. The eyes are bugs, so you don't eat them. What? What do you mean the eyes are bugs? The eyes are bugs, so you don't eat them? What does that mean? Okay, I gotta look this up. Uh, a crab flower? Wait, is it not an actual crab? It's a flower that looks like a crab, maybe? Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, so that's just some fantasy thing. I, I, I still wasn't exactly sure if the series was going for fantasy or just historical. But okay, so it is like mostly fantasy. Uh, I mean, it's it's very grounded in just like history. Uh, but it doesn't relate to any actual history going on. Which I thought was the point, right? Like I didn't think it was like a history manga. But like I thought it was just like taking place vaguely in the past. But no, that's not the case. It's just taking place in another world. Okay. But I actually really like that the series, like, setting is not really defined, right? Like, a lot of series use the first chapter to build up the world, which is terrible. You should use it to build up the characters. Uh, and honestly, just use the series to build up the characters and let the world become naturally around them. Uh, but I feel like too many other series just throw out so much jargon in the very beginning trying to build the world. But it's like, just, the world will come in due time. It's the characters that you, you need to focus on. Yeah, yeah, he ain't liking this. He's probably feeling its pain and everything. I mean, that's not good. This kills the crap. Mm -hmm. When you're close, does he mean, like, emotionally? Or does he actually mean, like, when I'm physically close to something, I can feel its pain? Okay, yeah, so it's just when he's actually physically close to it. So, yeah, he can make the body, but not it being sentient. Prime Goo Goo too, a limp Goo Goo that just lies there. Ugh. It's a horrible thing to think about. How can I break rocks? Hmm. Yeah, blast with fire. Then it, when he got in the water, it broke. If you cool down hot rocks too fast, they break apart. Okay. Okay. We're gonna go to a place to train with a whole lot of animals. Hmm. Yeah, we know where the knockers are, so we don't have to worry about it right now. It's more worrisome, you know, every other time we have to fight them, but this time, we're actually pretty good. We know where they are at all times. I mean, well, we don't really know where they are at all times, but we can ask at any point. Hmm. Something strange is going on here. Something bad's happening. Uh, okay, they're tickets, they're, are they slaves now? Yep, and then he got branded, but it healed up immediately. Puron's getting sold out for, like, prostitution stuff. Okay, so they're prisoners, not even slaves. Great, A world's paradise, okay! So, yeah, that's just a trick. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, it's like Africa all over again. <laughs> this is so fucking close to that. It's it's a bit weird. It's a bit tough to read. <laughs> but, all right, let's, let's read it. <laughs> oh, good dude. This is uh, <laughs> some territory I'm not sure how I feel about reacting to. Okay, so, I'm not sure why his legs aren't shackled. I'm not sure why that wasn't the case, but, um, his, his brand isn't even there because, yeah, it healed. But this girl, the one who sold us out, not, not only sold us out, right, like, she was just doing her job. 
Uh, not like she's a good person, but it's not like she singled us out. It was like, put them on the fucking boat. Like, we were just another person. But, like, it's still, it's her. Why is she saying it's her fault? What is she trying to do? Huh. But for what reason? Because it's fun here? Or because they have to act like they're having fun to just keep going? Uh, oh, is he asking that? Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. Because it's fun here or because they have to act like they're just having fun? I thought she was, like, saying, like, is it this or is this? Actually, it's... Yeah. Yeah, they smile here eventually. Huh. Where's the door? Uh, oh, oh, okay, he's saying on the other side of this. I didn't see there was a speech bubble on that panel. Can't dig under it. Can't climb it. Or we can, okay. Huh, what the fuck is the city? Wait, is that a gladiator arena? I think it is. And falling back down. Bam. Is this the same girl? Uh, I think so. She's got the shorts, the tan skin and everything. Yeah, that's probably not a good sight to, to see. Head smashed against the ground. Head caved open. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we saw it. That was awesome. So I guess the... I don't know. Are these people prisoners? Because they don't seem like prisoners. That owl is watching, though. If you can get your hands on that bird, I can get to their side. How? How so? This is not all right. <laughs> oh, that, that's her partner. Okay. Yeah, give me back my bow, you son of a bitch. <laughs> huh? This island is where they put uncontrollable, heinous murderers from all over. Uh, but... Yeah, it was not a mistake. Absolutely did not. Okay. The tournament? Okay, yeah. Winning in the arena, of course. We're doing this thing. Wait, what? If you win, you become... You get all power on the entire island? Okay. Sure. That's insane. But it's obviously rigged, and so no one can ever win. Yeah, he has no idea what an arena is. What are you doing in an arena? Yeah, let's better hope there's another match before you. Okay, it's been three days since the last leader died. So, there was a previous leader. I mean, obviously there has to be, but I assumed it was a leader that, like, never, you know, actually swapped. But, okay, so that does happen. Why doesn't one of the printers win and then go like, hey, fuck this, everybody's free? Why would they allow this arena? They're killing off their prisoners? This seems so unpractical. I just have to not die. I can totally win this. Uh, okay, that guy got shot in the fucking head and died. Okay. <laughs> what in the world? They just murdered the referee. Okay, and now someone else is taking it up. Let the battle begin. I'm the referee now. Fuck you. That guy just got his head literally chopped off. Okay. Gut busted open. Jesus Christ. This is brutal already. Oh, fuck. He can feel the pain of everybody. This ain't good. Oh, God. Yeah, there's still one more. Come to the wrong place. Nope. Right in our head. Bullseye. Too bad. Just take it out. Everyone's looking. They're gonna find out if I don't die. Mm. Can't waste time thinking. Not care about what people think of me. Or what will happen to me. Oh! Through the chest as well. That's how you protected Reen? Yeah, just... Don't give a shit about what will happen to you, what other people will think, or anything like that. Right, Gugu? Oh my god! Holy shit! Huh. 
Okay. That happened. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Oh, that's the end of the volume. Okay. To the next one. <laughs> I mean, I there's tons of immortal characters I've seen that get, like, mortal wounds and stuff like that, but at the same time, most immortal characters don't feel like they give a shit when they get injured at all. Like, like Ban from um, uh, Seven Deadly Sins, or the little bit I've read of that, like, uh, I don't know. I just never really cared that he was immortal. It just, like, was like, eh, sure, whatever. But, um, I don't know. The way that, that Emo, like, one, feels the pain of everyone else, and then feels his own pain, too, and, like, definitely reacts like it to a degree. He certainly doesn't act like he's just had an axe through his head, but he at least shows some emotion of pain, right? Alright, so now we're getting some backstory on our little bitch-ass character here, the one who sold us out. Seven years old. I'm sure she's gonna have a track. Oh, it's gonna have to take a lot for me to like this character. But, I mean, the booze man did some pretty fucked up shit too, and I ended up liking him in the end. But, not as fucked up as what she did. Either way. Seven years old. According to a book I read recently, if you're seven, your fate is entirely in God's hands. Cold. Oh, no, until you're seven. Yeah, just like March and all that. I don't wake up. My mother was dead. Okay. The church decided my father killed her. In the area we were from, the punishment for murder is exile. He pressed me for a decision. Stay behind. Live as an orphan. We're going to exile with my father. So, yep, she went. Hmm... What do we think happened? Did her father do it? I don't know. There's not much to go off of right now. So, okay. So, they're on a prison island, right? But they're not used for menial labor or anything like that. Like, it's not like there are people governing this island. It's literally just, if there's prisoners, take them to this island, dump them on there, and... Peace out. This is, I, is we're just Australia now. This island's just Australia. Uh, so I'm not sure how they really uh, keep a king that rules the rules the whole island just because he won the tournament. Like, uh, not really sure how that flies and how someone just doesn't run up and kill him. But I guess <laughs> if he won the tournament, he has to continue fighting in the tournament every time. Maybe, maybe. I'm not sure. Yeah, of course they don't want a leader. They're just doing this for fun. She was going to enter the tournament. Oh, no. Her papa was. And he, he probably died. How? Trying to escape on your own is too hard. How? Like, why would the prisoners stop you? Why wouldn't all the prisoners just band together and escape if there's no one on this island but prisoners? So I guess that would mean there isn't nobody, there is other people on this island besides prisoners keeping things in check, but they don't seem to keep things in check? I don't know how this works in any fucking way at all. I don't see the logistics behind any of this. Yeah, her father. Did he actually manage to win? Uh, oh yeah, the man left standing was not my father. Hmm. Just a pile of, bo a pile of bodies to burn. Oh, oh, wait, oh, okay. Never mind, that's what she meant by the man left standing was not my father. I thought she meant, like, as in, like, the murder had changed him. Like, him having to kill all those people, but... No. Still haven't found him. Uh, Ellen G. Dalton. Was that not her father, I'm guessing, then? Still. What would happen? So I guess she's never found her father in the pile of people. Wait, her father did win! Huh. Okay. Uh, I guess he just died of his injuries during the thing. Okay, turned eight and decided to begin my own story. I'm so confused, man. So, 
what was going on? Oh, 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 I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this arc. I, I don't know. Oh yeah, I guess everyone on the island is like super tanned just from having to be out in the sun the whole time. Like we see plenty of people who aren't shaded that way, but we can assume that they are tanned, especially more than him, the the boy who lived in the icy tundra. Lower that boy onto the boat. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so that was the, the man in the black, I, I assume. He's really trying to fuck with us. <laughs> yeah, now this guy's just trying to fake being dead. All stories have a turning point. It's maybe that point. I'm Tanari, sure. I don't care, but I do not care about this character. Don't care about her at all. <laughs> They're immediately trying to kill her. Uh, oh, what the hell just happened? Oh, okay, blow darts, okay. <laughs> Next time I'll use poison. So yeah, they're very capable. Yep, people know he's immortal now. Can't just easily kill the king. So, now, oh shit, I guess our plan fucked up. Now we actually gotta have a king. boop a doop a doop boop <laughs> Oh, great, yeah, so, get the boats ready, we're out of here, leave this kid behind. Fuck everyone else but him. Or, I guess, or, you know, save everyone else but him, fuck him, specifically. So yeah, it's just like, if one person tries to escape, even if it's like a group of people trying to escape, uh, everyone else would band against them and kill them immediately. So yeah, they're, and like, if somebody sees it and doesn't say something, they're gonna get killed too. It's a, it's just a big old murder fest. So you still have to be branded if you're a part of a prisoner's family? That's so fucking shitty. Oh yeah, he did. She was already taken in. Why wasn't she released? The serious offenders apparently poisoned ten Yanomi back in the day. Yeah, I guess she did. Yeah. What do you mean? We haven't killed any... I guess... We, no, have we killed anybody? Have we killed a single human? But now he's trying to fucking... <sighs> I don't even know how to explain, you know. But like, he's trying to egg him on. He's trying to be like, oh, but didn't you kill Goo Goo? I guess so. No need to pain yourself over humans who have chosen to die. I do like this, you know, it was a soft suicide. He, he knew that he was going to die, but he did it anyway. Not as saying, like, I want to die, but knowing it was going to happen, but doing it anyway. What's it going to be? Is it going to do the tournament or not? So is that not the man in black, then? I guess not. I just assumed it was, but he's clearly different, then. Uh... Climbing the wall again. We can't go any farther. Just gotta be stronger and stronger and stronger. <sighs> okay, so now she's in the tournament. Great, yep. She's in the tournament. And we're gonna have to fight her. Is this the girl that we fucked up her face? I, I didn't really look like her. I was thinking it could be her. But, I guess so. I don't remember what her name was. But, uh... The girl we stab. Mm. Her hands are covered, so it's hard to tell. 
We stabbed her through the hand. Her face got all fucked up. Uh, I, I guess it's probably her. I assume it is. Oh, no. Yeah, he killed this thing, but now he can turn into it, maybe. Yeah, he didn't set out to die, though. Whole area is covered with stone, though, but it's a mole. Only this body can squeeze through. Oh, yeah, he can't see when he's a mole. Oh, no, he was picked up by the goddamn thing. Yeah, the bird is just like, fuck you, you're doing the tournament. God damn it. <sighs> but this is a woman that we don't really mind killing. Okay, so not her first. We, we gotta go through some brackets first. Alright, this is all Berserker. Survivor of the first block. Yeah. Okay, did it not go through? It clanged. What did it hit on? What did it hit? I can't even tell. Oh, he just has an axe taped to him? Or, no, he probably made the axe. But yeah, he can just keep making more and more weapons. Hell yeah. Just block him with weapons. Oh, he's trying to bite into us. Oh, God. Just ate it. Yeah, he's not scared at all. No, he's ready to die at any moment. He's crazy. How about this? Blow fire at him. A oh, little bit of pang. He remembers March. Goo goo. What is meaning? Does that mean it's not useful? Hmm. What's he turning into? Oh! Shit! Okay, he's turning into a. Uh, uh, mm, I got this. Uh, Perona. That's what her name was. Oh, and she sees her. Okay. Ugh, I still don't give a fuck about that girl. Alright, turning to Perona. I want to eat that! Well, of course you do. Piece of shit. Oh yeah! We're super light, very nimble. Uh, what? Just oh, Is that her foot? Yeah, that's her foot. Kicking him across the face. Nice! They got a real combat uh, form now. Okay, he is alive. We just knocked him out good right so he must he that's so weird oh boy this is the whole steak and salad thing again oh boy <laughs> like okay uh because he forgets march he remembers perona but is how does he remember any of the moments regarding perona and march together and similar things like that oh boy it's really weird Oh, shit, wait, yeah! Fuck, I didn't even think about that! I was just thinking, like, his emotions towards her were strong enough now for her to... For him to transform into her, but no, I forgot, he literally can't do that. They have to be dead. So, she must have suddenly died for some reason. Not sure what, but people die. Just randomly, all the time. Oh, God, I really hope we don't turn into Piron at some point. Oh, God. Oh, my God, this girl. Oh, it's giving me such, like, Gantz flashbacks with Kato and that one Kansai dialect bitch. Like, oh, my God. I hate these characters who... It's the same situation of someone having morality and someone without it and them... Trying to act like they know what the fuck they're talking about, but they really don't. They have no fucking clue what's going on. Ugh. Ugh. I, I hate these characters so much. God, I hate her. It's not that I don't agree with this, but it's the way she is doing everything and talking about everything. And, like, she's just a huge fucking bitch. Like, not, like, a purposeful... But the fact that she acts the way she does and talks the way she does, like, 
Even so much as like, oh, I've already reflected on it at least twice. Like, go fuck yourself. You're one of the people that are better off dead. Why do you want him to like you? Yeah, she's still fucking captured. There's nothing you can do. Yeah, definitely. Trust the one we know. We've known her for four fucking years. Okay, he's getting closer to Piron, but it can't be that easy. Now, where are we, though? Okay, so we need a, we need a flying form, honestly. I don't. I feel like we're never going to get one because it would be too convenient, but really nice to have a flying form. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're... Yeah, we're in Perona's form. Probably died. Died proudly, probably. Yep, I think so. Got caught because of my own screw-up. No. I hope he doesn't take this advice. I hope he does not take this advice and just does what that... I don't even know her name. She said it a thousand times and I have no idea what it is. It starts with a T. But the, the, the uh, tanned bitch, like, uh, helping her out. Do your all for those who seek your aid. Yeah, we're getting her out of here. We're not leaving without fucking per, uh, Piron. See, now she's... Oh my god, you're trying to be our friend, but then now you're withhold, yeah, withholding information from us until we do what you want us to do? No. God, fuck this girl. I hate her so much. All right, here's our dude. Here's our new fighter. Let's begin. A kick, but he blocked it and broke her feet. But it doesn't matter because they're just going to heal back that quick. Hmm. So what are we going to do? He's very good at defending. Oh, no. No, no, no. Choco to make us pass out. So, yeah, into the mole form. Perfect. Okay, there we go. No, 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 it's not enough. If you're gonna surrender, now's the time. I don't think he will, though. Yeah, now they're just throwing weapons like crazy, but he ain't gonna allow it. Oh, shit! Oh, I guess he she grabbed one of the swords, or probably just made another sword. But, slashed it all down. Now he might surrender. Oh, but he got hit with the back. Ugh... And now everybody's probably going to kill each other over who shot him. Is he dead? I guess so. Oh, no, this is bro. Oh, he's still alive. Okay. Wait. He doesn't, he's not a prisoner. He's just family. Things that hurt are bad, so I don't want to do them. <sighs> Alright, he's doing it. He's going to help him out. But fuck her. Let's help them out. Fuck her. <sighs> Alright. Good, though. I'm glad we're helping them. They, they seem like good people. Oh, man. It's like hearing all their stories. So nice. No, shut up. We want to hear more of his stories. <sighs> what a fucking piece of shit. God, she's terrible. God, I... What is... Why is she such a terrible person? God, I hate her. Ugh. Oh, yeah, we can use Goo Goo. Light it up. Hell yeah. Turn back into the boy immediately. One is coming. What do you mean one is coming? A knocker? I guess so. But then why turn back into the boy? I don't know. Yeah, now the whole island's gonna hate him because he's not killing people. Oh, man. Oh, that feels good. Oh, hell yeah. Bloody nose and everything. Oh, that feels good. Yes.
I don't want much more to happen to her besides that, but I'm happy that happened. I'm happy she got decked in the face. Great, now a whole damn fight's broken out. Oh, yep. One's here, as I said. And now, lost the goo goo form. Just like that. Just like that. Lost it. <sighs> Great. But, we have a whole island of fighters here. We got that much, at least. No, I'll use fire again to... How did I use fire? No, we're not going to beat it. Right. She's going to do it anyway. I don't know. Like, if she dies and then we take her form... Oh, that's going <laughs> to... going to really be a dampen, damper on the series for me, man. I don't know. We got Perona, the wolf, the small thing. He still doesn't know the name of it. But yeah, the, the small thing and the crab. Wait, we can turn into a crab? I knew we could make a crab, but I didn't know if we could turn into it. Alright. Let's use our mole to get to the cracks. Jump onto it. And bite it apart. But mole's bite's probably not... Oh no, it did work! Gonna have to do it the hard way then. Nope. Oh boy. And she's gonna tangle us like that and fling us out. It's not gonna be that easy. It's gonna get me again. Yep. Now you're still here. Oh, the ground's splitting open again. Yeah, there we go. It's happening once more. It's way better when we're alone. People die when they're with us. Okay, good. This is what I wanted. Actual people from the island fighting this thing. Actual people I give a shit about. Yes, random characters have no name and have... This is the only one who's actually said anything of these people. But yes, I absolutely like them way more than that girl. Got it tied off. That's good. Great. Ground splitting open. Bunch of people are probably going to die there. Gotta be something I haven't tried. What is it? Someone shoot it? Uh, I guess they had some sort of... Yeah. They're packing explosives in their arrows. Between the rocks. But yeah, we, we suck at it. Turn into Perona. Hell yeah. Lend me your strength, baby. It's light and easy to use. Just what she needed. Right there. On the mark. For once. Come on. Hell yeah, I think it worked. Actually hitting the mark. She ain't missing anymore. Yeah, we got plenty. Did we actually manage to do it? Uh, okay. And the core. Oh, we're getting it back. <laughs> Got you back. And he's remembering that growing up is all about learning things again. Yeah, and Onigumo we finally got back now, too. And, oh, this is a great, like, moving from Perona to uh, back to the boy. And then Goo Goo. Oh, God, drinking cow's blood. Ugh, ugh. No, thank you. Ugh. God, I can't... Ugh. I'm thinking about the taste of, like, drinking blood. Oh, God. So... <laughs> Man, I, once again, I am so fucking happy that almost every single person we come, against, like, come up against... I, I, that's a weird way to put it. Every single person we meet or, you know, whatever, we trust, um, which is a lot of people, he just, like, tells them everything. Like, yeah, there's this guy in black that you guys can't see, but I can see. By the way, I'm immortal. I can take all these forms. The forms happen when people die. Like, he just lays it all out in the line. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love any series that can do that and not, like, have to keep everything fucking secret from everybody. Oh, the sun comes from the ocean. What? Oh, God. I love shit like this. Like, stuff that... 
like I I love ignorance in in like media in general. I I think the use of ignorance is one of the just like in general. Ignorance is one of the key components of any kind of fiction, right? Just ignorance in different ways. Some characters not knowing other things, you know, so on and so forth. Having a series in which everyone knows everything or only one person knows everything is kind of just like boring, right? This series, I just praised it for, you know, telling much characters, but not everybody knows, right? And there's levels of ignorance here. There's the care like you know there's there's uh Piron who knows of Perona and March and Gugu and all these you know people but she doesn't know the boy she doesn't know well no she doesn't she doesn't know the bear and everything but um then we have you know characters like this uh girl who I don't remember her name who doesn't know any of those other people but she knows Piron uh but she knows more about Piron than even Emo does like there's different levels of ignorance. I think ignorance is the the key to fiction. I think it's like the most. I don't know what how I how I'm trying to phrase it, but you know it's just like the the most key factor there, right? Like I don't think there's any other. I don't want to say like emotion. What what would like? I don't know. I don't know what what what, what that would be considered to be. But yeah. I, anyway. Completely went off topic. What I was trying to say is, I like, I love the idea of, like, the logical ignorance of this. Of, like, it's the same thing of, like, you know, when, when thunder, you hear thunder and you think it's gods, right? Because it happens up in the heavens. Uh, you know, you see the ocean come out of the ocean, right? It fucking comes out of the ocean into the sky and then back down into the ocean. Because they live on an island and they see no other land. She's probably grown up, like, while all the others have gone... From places to the island, she seems like she was birthed here. Like, she was born here. Yeah, born on the island. Fucking called it. Yep. So she doesn't know about other lands or anything. I mean, sure sure she knows about other lands, but she probably still thinks, like, just because of the logic, like, the sun comes from the ocean. And it's weird to say because of logic she thinks that, but that is a logical statement from her perspective. It is not a you know, illogical thing to say that. It is 100% logical for her to be saying the sun comes from the ocean. Oh yeah, he can make food for him. It's a feast. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, especially after that whole meal at uh, Reen's house. He's got a lot of food to make now. It doesn't matter, it's great. Can't wear his body, but it's great. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Oh, what an idiot. He accidentally, like, he just made all the food he knew, which included the, uh, <laughs> food they ate that made them pass out. Oh. Uh, but now, the girl's passed out. Time to read her diary. All right, we got March back. We can climb this thing. All right, because it's March. So, I guess, I, I've always said before, like, why is he turning into March for these kind of things? I guess he was climbing that, you know wall earlier as March. He, he wasn't just being thrown up because he was lighter. I, I guess I've just never taken March as our climbing character. I knew she climbed a tree, but I, you know, just thought that was because she was a small girl. Like, she doesn't seem like she'd be able to climb a fucking mountain like this, but I'll go with it. Sure. It's March. She can do anything. We're here. Hey, how's it going? Pop. And we're into the room. Now, how do we get her out of here? Break down the door with one swipe, sure. Hmm. If I win that, I can get a boat and sail right out of here. Okay. Let's do it. But that was nice that we just went to visit her, at least. Like, we got it. We finally were able to get to her. But now, we got Emo versus our burnt-faced girl. Uh, our ultimate villain. Okay, yeah. Sweet. So we can use Opa's blowgun to put him to sleep. Sweet. That is that is a good sentiment. I will at least appreciate that. A pitiful girl, wasn't she? Having her hopes and her dreams all cut short. Oh, man. I am so happy that the burn marks are, like, as, like, tears, almost. Oh, boy. This is gonna be a good fight. This is gonna be a good fight. I cannot wait for you to die. Oh, she looks horrid. 
oh man, I'm glad that like her her just entire body's in ruin now. Like there's no coming back from it. She's just like her lips are burnt, her eyes are burnt, her face is burnt. She is just oh, ruined. Okay, now he's gonna try and fucking kill her. What is going on? Is she just like really good? I guess. Like, okay, I, I, she must just be really good. This almost seemed like she was floating there, but I think she was just landing. That's a weird panel, but uh, she's, she's blinding us. Oh, great, she pulled out her eye. Okay, now we're fighting as Perona. This is a, a good matchup, Perona versus her, I like it. It was my gift to you. Oh, cool, so, wait. But Perona, like, had to have died in the middle of like, the tournament, right? Because we just suddenly turned into her. And I assume that was the moment when she died. As it has been every other time. Oh, boy, this woman just really wants to die, doesn't she? You really want to die. And that's what she's hoping for. She wants you to kill her. Oh, I have a feeling we're going to turn into her, too. We're not going to like it, but we're going to because... We have deep emotions with her, even if it's not good ones. Yep, we're immortal, but we can't do shit. Oh, great. Yeah, the Western Morning Glory again. And we lost. Oh, but we did. We got in at least one hit. Wasn't much, but we got in a hit. Mm. Yeah, so she's just planning to take him back. Protect this strange creature. Fuck does that mean? Why is she doing this? What is she gaining out of this? She's gonna what? Why? What in the world? What? is happening what is she aiming for she branded herself okay why i have absolutely no idea why she would want to do this hmm i think he's remembering the yeah back here with the booze man and everything oh no he's just like you know, a fake memory. Now even she's here in this fucking dream. Will we kill her? And again, she licked our fucking face. Why is she doing that? What is wrong with this woman? Okay... Okay, they're going to rescue us. Let's move on to the next volume as well. Oh, man. I, I legitimately can't even begin to guess what her motive could possibly be. I have no idea. I have no idea at all. I don't know. She's fucking crazy. She's got this big old fancy house for him and everything. lick his face again okay so she's hmm okay she's trying to gain his immortal powers I guess somehow in some way I guess so I'm glad she's also burnt like down her entire fucking body like yeah I'm very happy about that. Oh boy, oh boy, this is, this is a good shot. It's the, it's, a, it's the perfect fan service. It's fan service not for the nudity, but for the injury. <laughs> what is on his talon? He has something on his talon. Uh, is that also just poison? I guess. I guess. <laughs> Fucking funny. <laughs> it's just like the Goonies. <laughs> 
is so weird. I like I like all of these kids except for her. Yep, she's got more of her Yamone people here, or they're, or she just convinced these people to do that. Probably the probably the latter. Oh, he got out. Press right against the throat. What are you gonna do? Oh my god, that was just an empty husk. He did it. He fucking did it. The foreshadowing on that. Oh, hell yeah. An empty husk. Get fucked. Yep. Turn. Wait, no, no. He just made a mole? And then... Or is that... I'm not sure how... What's going on here. Uh... I guess he made the mole and then switched his consciousness over to the mole? I guess he can do that, apparently? Oh, come on. We don't have Perona on here? Seriously? Getting stronger together? I like. I love this image so much, but we don't even have Perona on here. But, I mean, he wasn't as emotionally connected to Perona as he was these three. Alright, Tanari, who are you going to pick? Who are you taking with me? We got 700 people. That's quite a lot. Children seven and under. Deserve a chance to choose their own fate. Sure. Do we have seven hundred children on this island? <laughs> Should be whoever's not a you know whoever's just family of prisoners, the you know the kids, and then we can maybe pick some more. Making them all pass out. Oh my god, I made him pass out again as well. Put him down to a dark, dark hole. Okay. Great. So she's dead? Or is this... No, no, this is Tanari. This is actually Tanari. Okay. Uh, who is this? Okay, so she's been planning to break him out. I have nothing to ever say whenever it's just her on screen. But someone caught her. Who is it? Hmm. Is it... Oh, what? <laughs> wait, wait, was it another fucking empty husk? <laughs> uh. Okay, we're having another dream now. Uh, wait, what? He's having a dream of her memory? Oh, no, no, no. This is Tonari, I think, saying that. Yeah, that, this is her book thing, I guess. Yeah, sorry, but that ain't happening. That ain't happening. She's probably gonna die. She's absolutely gonna die by the hands of Burnt Girl, who I still don't know her name. Not not because I don't like her as a character. I, she's a really good villain, but I don't like. I just don't remember her name. And I'll, oh, Hayase. Okay, well there we go. Hayase. Okay, I gotta remember that. Great knockers have arrived and are about to attack the city. Hmm? Our opponents can be taken out with a single sword. How so? Yeah, why aren't they coming to him? I feel like Hayase is going to be an immortal. I absolutely feel like she's going to be an immortal. Coming up through it. Who is that? What is going on? People are just dying left and right. Okay, no, yeah, they're all just... There's a lot of knockers. How in the world? What? It, so, I guess all the people... he Because, like, normally the knockers have to take one of his forms, right? Otherwise, they're just, like, plants. But these people are still plants, but I guess it's all the people who've died here. Okay, and these guys left, too. Sure, we're probably going to let everyone on this island off, which is not a good thing to do, but we're going to do it anyway, probably. Oh, uh, there we go. It's trying to, like, enter her, I guess? Yeah, and it stings. Oopa fell, but she's probably dead already. Yep, and now she's dead, too. Is he going to be able to turn into all these kids? 
what what happened here? How did that? What is what is that? Did it make that? The knockers. Well, the two of them just went down like that. Ah, oh, fuck! It got the boy. God damn it! It got the boy. Uh, people are dying all over the place. Or is that just the pain from her? It might just be the pain from her. Because he does have to be physically close, right? But she ain't dead, apparently. And now we can't heal wounds. Can't do everything. We gotta protect us. Yeah, we, we gotta protect them while they're, while they're doing this. We have to. She's already dead. I don't think he's going to be able to do it. He's going to hesitate. And now you're fucked. <sighs> yeah, he knew he was going to die here. He took her away, knowing that they're both done for. Wait, was she already turning before? Uh... Oh, oh, is that... I thought that was grabbing the... Still the immortal boy. Okay. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He noticed that it grabbed her and he was... Or maybe him. Him or her. I guess her because, it, you know, she then killed him. Yep. Oh, wait. March down too? Okay. Hold up. He's like, nope. This ain't happening. Cut off my fucking arm. I'll throw you. Okay. Hurry up. Yeah, he knows he's going to die still, but. Alright, off you go. Oh, the, the, the eagle. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, see ya, buddy. Time to meet your friends. He's going to have a lot of forms to turn into this time. God, an army of dead thousands. I was wondering why they never burned their bodies, so it's for plot convenience. <laughs> because, realistically, those bodies, after thousands of years, or maybe not thousands, like hundreds of years, they said there was thousands of tournaments, so it's got to be at least hundreds of years or so. And they said hundreds, not a hundred, well, I guess they said over a hundred, but like over a hundred people come to this island every single day... Which, in this time period sort of thing, I don't know how it's po fucking possible. But, also, then, there's, like, hundreds of people die every day, too. Like, th that pit of bodies would be stinking up the entire island. Like, the ent you would never be able to go to escape that smell. Anywhere you go, it would be terrible. Oh. She's turning into it. Whoa, 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 what'd she do? She ripped off her thing? What's she planning to do? Right? Like, it's taking over her, so what's she gonna... Uh, what? How in the fuck did she... Oh, she literally clawed her arm out to get the core. God damn. She is willing to go through insane amounts of pain. You can see the bone there. Did it actually get away? Yeah, it got away, got away. She didn't kill it. Okay, so she's gonna kill her. Uh, for some reason. Nope, he ain't gonna let it happen. I don't know how someone hasn't died yet. Hmm. What is he planning to do? He still doesn't want to kill her. He's feeling, oh, he's feeling her pain. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's feeling her pain. Fire from Gugu? Yep. I doubt he killed Hayase. I highly doubt it. Yeah, burning them is gonna work wonders on corpses. Only three knockers remain. Okay, who is it? Oh, great. It's those three. Of course it is. 
Uh, should have guessed that. Shall I kill? Wait, whoa, wait, what? 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 Uh, uh, huh? She got it? She got the immortalness. Or not? Wait, what? 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 Because back here, look, she's like normal, right? She's fine. Wait, no, but then you can see the scars and stuff. Okay, maybe that was just an artistic mistake then. I'm gonna have to guess that was just an artistic mistake then? And that she's not like back to normal? She didn't become immortal as well with her generative powers? Because you can see the scarring here too? Yeah. Okay. I guess it was just that one panel. He didn't draw her face all fucked up. She is so... Yeah, she's just like broken, right? Because she wasn't like this before. Just over these five years, she just became obsessed with him. And like, it, yeah, to a insane degree. She is trying to like join him at this point. Like, you know, like, let's go do whatever you want to do, but bring me along so I can kill everyone for you. All right. I mean, just let her do it. She trying to yank backwards? Yeah, she's trying to pull her into the fire with her. Mm, boy, that ain't a way to go. That is not a way you want to go. I, man, as much as I would want to like do this for somebody, which I probably never would, because <laughs> let me live before anybody else. Uh, everybody else can die before me, for all I care. Uh, but uh, I, there's no way I'll be able to do that. No way. It's fire. Not gonna happen. Okay, I gotta say. This is a fucking amazing panel. Absolutely amazing panel. Honestly, one of the best in the series so far. I hate that it's for a character I hate. But yeah, he ain't gonna let it happen. He's gonna save both of them. Oh, he put her to sleep. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's just a thing in the series now. Just put everyone to sleep immediately. And it does seem like uh, after you've been put to sleep, it, you know, the effects... Are shorter and shorter every time but uh i just love that we're just like i ah, put him to sleep that ah, put him to sleep put him to sleep put him to sleep all right she's gonna do it herself yeah don't no let's do it okay good i hope we don't have to see it yes thank god we don't have to see it the injured or, or i don't know <laughs> doing whatever we can for him not much we can do. Hey, <laughs> don't, don't say that in front of this kid. The, these three are my reason for living. Uh, emo, you're kind of cool too. Other kid, yeah, fuck you. I never really cared about you. <laughs> okay. That's a good way to spin it. Mountains of corpses attract evil things. First, we have to stop the killing and help each other to avoid needless death. All right. That's a pretty good way to, to, to say it. Alright, they're going to stay there. Sure, at this point, why not? The island's been changed. Oh, what is this cover image? Do not be afraid to live. Oh, I really like... This is... This just sums up the whole damn series, don't it? This really is just like the perfect page to describe the series. Not to anyone who hasn't read it, but like... For people that have read it, this is the abs this is just a synopsis of the series. <laughs> this image is a synopsis of the series. <laughs> Alright. Okay, we're gonna take Hayase with us. Sure. But yeah, so those were people from Yamone. Like they they weren't people she she convinced or anything. They they are people from Yamone, okay. All right, let's head out. Let's go meet up with Piron. I really hope, I honestly really hope that Piron stays in the series forever. Like, I hope she's the one that never does die. Uh, or, you know, at least not to, like, the very end of the series. I want her to be, like, the one consistent thing in this series. The one consistent character. Uh, okay. 
now we got this bird going with us, apparently. Uh, she's waking up alone on a boat with him. Just what she wants. Simply want to be by your side. Ah, uh, yeah, she's got like, she's so fucking insane. Ah, uh, I'm gonna really, really like her. Uh, I've already, she was already like, I really liked her before, even in the original arc, just because I love a character that can make me hate them so much. Like, villain-wise, like when I'm supposed to hate them. Like, I'm not supposed to hate this girl, but I, I don't like her. I don't hate her anymore. I really don't hate her. I certainly don't like her, and I don't even dislike her anymore. I'm just like, eh, I just, eh, I just want to be done with the arc. Like, I don't even want to be done with the arc, I just want to be done with her. Like, again, I don't dislike her at this point. But I'm just kind of like the most neutral I can be on her. I'm just like, yeah, whatever. She's a character. Let's move on. Yep. It's insanity. Really? Since that day? I don't know about that. I'd have to go back and look at it. Uh, let's do that right now real quick. Let's go back and look at that uh, image specifically of when he, you know, tur was turning into those things and she, she saw him. Where was that? Was that in Volume 2 or was that in Volume 3? Where did Volume 2 end? Oh, yeah, that ended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That ended after March's death and everything. Or, no, 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 wait, wait. Is this with the Goo Goo shit? No, no, no. This was the first forest fight. Okay, okay. So, back a bit. That might have been Volume 1, actually, then. Yeah, she certainly looks in love there. I'll give her that. Huh. But she was, she was not as obsessed as she is now. But, like, when she first saw it, she was like, Oh, this is a, my likey, I likey. Oh, my God. So, I don't think she was trying to fuck him to get his powers. I think she was just trying to fuck him. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. So, she does want him to kill her. He, she absolutely wants that to happen. That's what she's just trying to do. She's like, I just want to be by your side until you fucking kill me. So I can become one with you. Oh, he just made another boat and he's like, fuck you. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, this is actually pretty goddamn tragic. Like, d d I, yeah, I don't know. I, I. Not much I could say about it, but just like, I hate her, and I'm glad it's happening, but at the same time, oh man, that's gotta suck for her. Uh oh, uh oh! It's the one you let get away. And she's dead. Just like that. Wow, I was not expecting her to die! <laughs> oh boy, but actually, she's not dead. She's probably a uh, knocker now. Alright, we're at the port. We're gonna meet up with Piron. Seems to be the end of this arc. Let's move. Okay, yeah, yeah. All right. Well. Oh, boy, this is a long arc. And I think it's going to be the first one where the entire arc is going to be all one video. Which I'm very happy about. This is the kind of series where I really kind of wish I did do that. Uh, like, I, I hate that all the other arcs have been split up into two parts. Well, one, the first chapter was by itself. But then we had marches into two videos and we had gugus into two videos. Now this is going to be one video, and then we're going to go back to multiple videos again, because after this, I'm not sure how long the next arc is going to be, but we only have, yeah, we're on volume 6 right now, so I have the rest of these chapters. I'm on chapter 52 right now, so we got 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58. I think we're up to 58 right now. I think so, so we got six chapters left. Um, at least that's the last chapter I've downloaded, I think, is 58. Uh, so yeah, we got like six chapters left. That's gonna be the next video probably tomorrow very hungry and it's pretty late So I'm gonna eat and go to sleep uh, But yeah, at least I didn't cry at the end of this one. At least I still have a little bit of fluid left inside me um, Overall, I feel like you know, I didn't like the girl so it did it did harpen a little bit on this um, but Overall it was a fine arc. It was not you know, it's definitely my least favorite, but uh, I still liked it a lot. I still liked a lot of stuff that was going on in it. Pretty much everything that wasn't uh, 
T- t- uh, t- starts with T. T- um, <laughs> t- go- it's not Tagora. Uh, t- uh, t- tapioca pudding. Whatever. That's her name now. Uh, it's everything that didn't have to do with tapioca. I liked. Like, I don't know. I just I couldn't get into her. Uh, I just can't. I can't. I don't like those kind of characters. I really don't. I, I know they're going to have redemption, but I still don't care. But, yeah, everything else was great. We got more forms. We got the mole. We got... Uh, we got Perona. We got... The crab. And we got... Uh, what else did we get? I feel like we got another one, didn't we? Maybe not. Well, probably those three kids. But we don't know that for sure yet. Well, actually, I'm not sure yet, because he turns into the thing right after they die, usually. Um... So, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But, potentially, we'll turn into uh, Hayase at some point. But I doubt it. I highly doubt it. Alright, I'll see you guys for the next one. And now to stop this recording and then not touch my computer for like 30 minutes so I know that this file is not going to get corrupt. So, okay, I'll see you guys for the next one. Get the fuck out of here. Carefully hit stop.